Hello my friend, welcome back to another video. So my last video, well not my last video, but one of my last videos in my Dutch pour collab that I did, my Dutch pour wasn't quite dry, so it has now dried and it dried really well. I'm quite happy and pleased and you really, ah, back just fell off on my, my furniture leveler. <laughs> Uh, but you really can't see it very well. So, hmm, what am I going to do here now? Ah! Well, I have to find a better angle for you to be able to see this, because this is not what I had in mind. Right, well, apparently I'm not going to be able to get a good view of it. My furniture my levelers are coming off. <laughs> but, um, it is... It has dried really well, and it does have a little ding right here. Maybe I didn't mix up. I don't know if you can see it. You probably can. Oh, yeah, there you go. That right there. And then there was another one right there. But other than that, it dried beautifully. I love it. I love the way it turned out. But when I get it resined, I will show you this again and in the sunlight so you can see all the beautiful shimmery and glimmer in it but um for today's video here let me do this <laughs> so for today's video i am going to do another marble pour i really enjoyed doing that marble pour that was a lot of fun um and this time i will be using i guess br turner um has two different recipes that he goes by the four to one or three to one this particular mixture is going to be a four to one and um i just gotta say hey thanks br turner this has been fun and you know everybody out there is doing it and you gotta jump on the marble bus wagon <laughs> the marble train <laughs> So uh, I'm going to go ahead and put you on down and we'll get started. All right, and we are back. And so here I am going to go ahead and flood my canvas, which is a, <laughs> excuse me, a 10 by 20. Um, I'm going to flood it with Liquitex Basics Titanium White. And then as my, for my colors, I have, I'll do it this way. I have a mixture here because I ran out of the Golden's Benzina Dang Yellow. <laughs> Can't pronounce that. So there's a, some of this and there is some Amsterdam Primary Yellow, a squirt of that in there. And a squirt of Amsterdam's Azo, Azo Yellow Medium. So this is... those and it's kind of hard to see because of the yellow cup but i guess now you can see it all right oh i need to turn on my ring light and you can see a little better ha ha let there be light <laughs> okay so that's the yellow move those out of my way and next up is going to be artist loft aqua green with a splash of Joe Sonia's turquoise iridescent. And that looks like it's got a little bit of a shimmer to it. Never tried this colors, the mixing colors in a ring pour, or obviously or in the marble pour, because I've only done a few of these. But there's a nice little shimmer on there. Hopefully it'll work out as well in the marble pour. Marble technique. Pinball. Whatever <laughs> whatever it's being called these days. And this one here is just Artist Loft Metallic Cobalt Blue. One of my favorite colors from Artist Loft. Gorgeous, shiny color. I think I hope my ring light's working here. <laughs> okay, and then my next colors are going to be Artist Sloth Neon Violet with a splash of the 
deco nope folk art color shift purple flash yep that is that and this has a little hint of some shimmer to it Uh, hopefully nice thick consistency I'm gonna stick stand straight up <laughs> and then I also have some artist loft Mars black which I threw the container away because it was the end of that all right so I am going to probably speed through this and play some music for you while I flood the canvas and put my dots down and I'll come back with you and we'll uh, play with this. All right, so there's my petals, and I'm a little worried <laughs> that I maybe didn't put down enough paint, but I have some white left, so I'm going to go ahead and pour it around here, and we'll get the marble on here, and roll it around. Oops. Dang it. Well, the marble's gonna go through there anyway, right? <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hi, Gibson. Pardon the cat. He's uh, very needy. I had to go run and grab him some water. He was comp <laughs> Poor kitty was completely out of water. Uh, I'm a bad stepmama, huh? He's not my cat, he's my nephew's cat. What, Gibson? Alrighty, so let's go ahead and get the party started. I've been thinking for myself, asking for help, but nothing seems to work on you. Yeah, you always make
All that I crave when you're away, nights are sleepless. Do we need space? Yeah, maybe you're brave. Boy, you're my weakness. Giving we take the love that we make. It's my favorite drug. Too caught up in your love. I've been trying to forget, but you won't let me. Something in my brain holds you. Take it away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love. I've been trying to forget, but you won't let me. Something in my brain wants you. I've been thinking by myself, asking for help. Yeah, you, you always make me feel like oh yeah you. you never leave my thoughts alone yeah you you're the reason I'm going out of my mind I just can't stop thinking about you Call that one good and oh I'm happy with it I am very happy with this it's got some cool effects in it make sure you get that corner that one's a little bare just a little bit <laughs> these ones are all pretty good we get a popsicle stick underneath this. And get some of the runoff. And then I'll bring you guys down and give you a close up. All right. I am pretty much loving this painting. There's some awesome definition and some composition. I really love tilting. <laughs> I like tilting. I like to being able to put the paint pretty much where I wanted to and make it move and make more go in other places. And it's just really awesome. Tilting's fun. <clears throat> Excuse me. And the colors, I mean, you get purple. I really, <laughs> I was amazed. I really didn't, wasn't sure how well these were going to play together. And they play really well together. I like what's going on right in there. It's awesome. And the shift, I'm not really sure if you can see any of that shift in there. But you can definitely see some turquoise. Or not turquoise, but the, well, yeah, that too.
Mm, I'm looking over my phone. All right, let me turn the... Oh, this looks like a mouth. Little nose right there. All right, let me turn my flush on. I wasn't getting as many cells as I thought I would for this being all Floetrol and paint. <laughs> kind of going all over the place, too. My apologies for that. Got some good sides here. The sides are pretty decent. Happy with those. Let me tell you, these runoffs, too. These runoffs are pretty awesome. They peel right the heck off this mat. <laughs> Couldn't be happier. All right, anyway, let me turn off the flash. I will be, or on, turn the flash on. <laughs> I will be right back. All right. Lots of shimmer. Yeah, lots of shimmer. This is cool. Let me see if you can see any of that flash. Or if it will change, shift, color shift. Anyway, it's still cool though. I still love the way that it turned out. I think it's pretty awesome. That metallic cobalt blue is just gorgeous. I love it. It's too bad that these cameras don't do these paintings any justice. <laughs> Because what I see and what you guys see are two totally different things. That's some awesomeness right in there. Yeah, totally different. This is turquoise and you guys are seeing blue. Such a trip. Anyway, so I will not be showing you the drive, dried painting, dried results in this picture in this video because I am going to get this video out today. So I will show you the results in my next video. And until next time, my friends, I hope you are well, hope you, everything's good. And uh, hope you have a good day, good night, whatever it may be for you. And um, thank you for your lord oh look at that right there right there that looks that right there is pretty awesome looking so thank you to my current subscribers you guys mean the world to me and without you I wouldn't have my wonderful audience, <laughs> my wonderful subscribers and family that I'm having. And I have a wonderful family in my paint pouring community. I'm pretty happy with it. I mean, I'm very happy with it. They're just honest, good-hearted, kind people. And everybody's there to help. Everybody's there to have fun. Everybody has the same passion, the same... They all want the same results they want to have fun and paint the beauty of it so anyway so thank you thank you all thank you for following me on my journey and um i will see you in my next video take care